definitely not a bluegill. Whatever this is, it's big. Oh my goodness, guys. Big old bass on a worm and bobber. Six pound fluorocarbon. Oh my. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. This bass is not getting tired. No, I can't. You're, you're screwed right now. Oh my goodness. Look how pale he is from the dingy water. He's a three pounder anyway. <laughs> we always have fun just catching bait, don't we? That's with a little tiny gold hook, too. I'm lucky I even got him. Especially with that gold hook. Little tiny cricket hook. My gosh, guys. It's going to be a minute. Yeah. He's almost completely white because this water is so dingy. Wow, that's a big bass. And you had something that wasn't a bluegill too, didn't you? I don't know. Well, guys, that's a good start. Wilma is hooked into a big old buffalo, it looks like, or a channel cat. No, no it's not. It's a carp. It's a buffalo. Yeah, that's a big old smallmouth. My God, he's 10 pounds. Easily 10 pounds. Whew. All right, let me get the hook out. Good Lord, maybe that's what broke my line, man. Something like this anyway. That's on a gold hook or the bigger hook? Good God, you're lucky. Hold on, don't do nothing. Okay. Um. That may be a black. Mouth buffalo, about 10 pounds. What a loss. <laughs> Good. Oh. Nice. That is a black it's or sweet. hybrid of some kind. It's got the big poofy lips. Hooked into something big here. We don't know what yet. We think it's a bass, but don't reel up anymore. It's a large mouth, I think. Just let him tire down. Quit trying to reel. Maybe a cat. That... What? Got what? Following it? Oh my god, that's a five pounder. Grab its lip. 
don't do that. No. Oh man. That's a five pounder again. Oh my gosh, she landed it guys. Hey, we may not be catching bluegill, but at least we've caught other things, I guess. We've caught two nice bass now and a big buffalo. That's a f pure five pounder. He's five pounds. My Lord. Oh my God. Oh, I know, that's crazy. No wonder I had one break my line earlier. Don't lose that fish. It's a damn. <clears throat> you know what the problem is? Facing the sun. Go ahead. <laughs> Man, that's a tank. That is a nice largemouth guy. She done this two years in a row. Last year it was a seven pounder. Seven pounder last year. This guy's only about five. We do him diagonal like that once. Diagonal. Makes it look big. Why this? You think it's small? No, but I'm saying it makes it show it's true. Man. This line? <laughs> that is nice. God. Once right uh, up and down one time. Oh, like God. up and down. That's heavy. Now I gotta back up. Oh my. Okay, good job, honey. It's a nice fish, guys. I gotta change my battery. Imagine coming here with minnows in the early spring, like mid-May. We need to do that next year, I guess. I think we can get an eight-pounder out of here. Okay, wait. Here, really give me my camera. I want to show, really show myself releasing it. God. We could keep it if we wanted, but that's all right. What was that? God. Leo, I Leo. All right, guys, I apparently have hooked into a gigantic bass or a buffalo. I don't know which one. I had to loosen my drag because I got six pound line. This may be a seven pound bass. If it's, it's not a catfish, it's either a buffalo or a bass. If this is a bass, he's like six or seven pounds. I can tell you it's not a catfish because he's not whipping his tail. It's not a buffalo either. It'd be fighting way harder. This is a, a big old bass like you just had. Guys, we may not do limb lines tonight at the rate we're going, but we are catching the hell out of some good fish. Just trying to catch limb line bait. Funny how that works. Man, I don't know what this is. It ain't coming up. Don't you think a bass would have jumped by now? You know what I mean? This hasn't jumped. I could have a little channel cat and it just feels real big because of the line I got. Oh great. Anchor. I don't I'm sorry. I didn't mean to yell. I just got excited when I seen it. That's a weird looking channel cat. It's gigantic. The fact it hasn't cut my line yet's a miracle, Wilma. I gotta let him wear down. When you get a clear shot, yes, but not yet. He's gotta come more to the top. And it ain't happening anytime soon, apparently. See? Oh my 
guys this is a giant channel cap for six pound ultralight this is very challenging any second this guy could just rub break my line with his bumps on his lips not from the fight itself because i got the drag but if he rubs that line wrong it's over and catfish have really big like sandpaper on their lips especially their bottom lip if it just rubs side to side a few times it's over that's a 10 pounder I have to completely wear him out just like the hybrid striper it won't be that long of a battle but it's going to be another minute or two. My God, he was right on the bank, Wilma. Right in the rocks. I didn't think that's what this would have been. I thought it was a bluegill. This could be a flathead. It's starting to look like one. If this is a flathead... I'm going to be really happy. Nice fish either way, guys. Well, we got a five minute battle so far, according to the camera. My main goal is to keep him out of that damn anchor back here. He can hit that fish basket, but that ain't good either. nine pound channel definitely not a flathead he was gray yeah we did good now if i get this fish we had a good trip because the buffalo and large mouth each getting a nice one get you need to get your other line out of the water I don't want to take a chance. I've got too many damn things I got to try to dodge. And you want to add to them. I already got the, the anchor. It's a male channel cat. They are big and poofy already. Oh my God. Guys with a cricket hook, an Aberdeen hook. I need you to get the new, there's a new pair of gloves in the green bag on this end, the, right next to the basket. Boy, it's an ugly male, bullheaded male. Whew. Boy, he's got something wrong with him. He's been rooting around in the rocks. Well, they make the new one. That's an, yeah, he's two pounds. Put it. Hold, hold it. Show it. Up. I got it up. Look at my position. It's hard. You can't lift your elbow up? That's enough. I can't. You're real low. Try to lift. There you go. Okay. Put it, put it. Okay. Take the camera off my head. All right, guys, this is at least, he's 
about eight or nine pounds anyway. It's heavy. It's a heavy chain of head. Where'd he go? thing is freaking huge the belly is just gigantic <sighs> what a channel cat guys wow what a beast look at that belly just look at that belly hang down. Ow! Ow! That's enough. Okay. You go ahead. <sighs> okay. Wowzers, guys. Hi. You may have a cat again, huh? I don't know. Bass. It's fighting more like a bass as quick as it got over here. I guess you never know, but... Let him tire down. Quit reeling. Just let him get tired. Don't reel up anymore at all. You'll create too much tension on that bobber. I can't tell yet. If it is, it's a small one. Nah, it's not bad, I guess. Hey, it's a keeper. All right, nice channel cat, guys. Another two pounder. Don't get it all over the cooler. My Lord. No, but... Then it's gonna land right on my freaking tackle box. Why don't I just give you the plot? Hold the fish. Hold the fish. I don't need to hold it. Put yes, it you do. Put your hands right there where I can get the hook out. I'll get it if you hold it. You're letting him get all over everything. Tackle boxes, bags. Hold on, I'm gonna hold it up for us. Hold it up for us. Problem with filming you is the sun is behind you. And I can't do a damn thing about it. That's enough. There's nothing I can do. Okay. Or not. in here. 